amepokea kwa mikono miwili salamu zetu za pole na kwamba wachina pamoja na hali ngumu walionayo wanaendelea kupambana na hali hiyo ili kuokoa nchi ya china na watu wake e, kuondokana na ugonjwa huu tunafurahi wachina sasa angalau ugonjwa umepungua kwa kiasi kikubwa na wanaendelea na shughuli zao kadiri hali inavyokuendelea lakini pia tushukuru sana serikali ya china kwa kukaa na watanzania wetu kule tulikuwa na wanafunzi zaidi ya 532 kwenye mji wa huwa ambao pia mbio support sana kuwahudumia vifaa chakula na wakamudu kukaa kipindi chote cha tatizo na serikali tumefurahishwa sana na mheshimiwa balozi wa Tanzania chini china mheshimiwa Mbelwa amekuwa akitupa taarifa za mwenendo wa jitihada zenu e, kuondokana na ugonjwa huu mpaka mmefanikiwa leo hii sasa Tanzania tumeanza kupata tumepata tatizo hili na tunaanza kurati, tunaendelea kujitahidi kupambana nalo ili kuzuia maambukizi asije kazaga nchi nzima tunaendelea na jitihada za kuzuia kuambukiza tumezuia mikusanyiko tumeelimisha watu kukaa mbali wanapopata huduma lakini pia tunajitahidi kupeleka elimu mpaka vijijini watu wanawe mikono wapake vile zile dawa za kuwa vijidudu mikononi na maelekezo kadhaa tunaendelea kuyatoa kila siku kadiri hali inavyokwenda sisi tunafanya tathmini ya ugonjwa huu kila siku na wataalamu wako bize na hatua hizi tunaweza kuzichukua kadiri wataalamu wetu wanavyofanya tathmini na kuishauri serikali ndatambua tumesimamisha tumefunga shule zote tumezuia michezo mikutano makongamano malengo yetu ni kwamba tuweze kusambaza ugonjwa kutoka mtu mmoja mpaka mtu mwingine hatua kadhaa zinaendelea kuchukuliwa lakini pia tushukuru sana kwa msaada ambao mmetuletea wa vifaa madawa eh, kutoka Jack Mo ambao tumepokea wiki mbili zilizopita na nashukuru leo umesema kwamba bado jamii ya wachina wafanye biashara hata pia walioko hapa ndani wa kandarasi wanafanya makus- wanakusanya vifaa mbalimbali kutuletea Tanzania ili vitusaidie e, katika kuzuia maambukizi haya. Tunashukuru sana. Na kwa kweli mchango wenu ni muhimu sana kwetu kwa sababu ndio tunaanza tunaanza kupata uzoefu wa damu ya kupambana na ugonjwa huu. Tanzania bara na Zanzibar tunaendelea kupata wagonjwa na tunaendelea kujitahidi kuwaweka mahali ambako wanapata huduma. Tunashukuru wa Tanzania kama nilivyosema pande zote mbili wanaendelea kujikinga na kuchukua tahadhari kutosamba kutozunguka ovyo kutakutana kwenye maeneo hayo e, malengo ni kwamba ugonjwa huu usiweze kwenda mbali zaidi tunatizwa na jiji la Dar es Salaam na Zanzibar kwa sababu ya uwepo wa kituo cha eh, viwanja vya ndege ambako wenyeji wageni wengi walikuwa naingia na kesi zetu nyingi ilikuwa ni wageni wanaoingia. Kwa hiyo tumezima mipaka yote. Hakuna ndege inayoingia nchini. Kwenye mipaka yetu jirani nako na pia kila anayeingia lazima akubali kwenda isolation center na atakaa hapo kwa siku 14 tena kwa gharama zake. Walio wengi wanaacha kuja. Kwa ni jambo ambalo pia na sisi linatupa amani kwa sababu tunabaki wenyewe ili tuendelee kuangaika na walioko ndani na kwa mahusiano tulionayo kati ya China na sisi na Tanzania tunategemea kupata uzoefu zaidi kutoka kwenu. Na umeeleza nataka kuanzisha program ya kubadilishana mawazo kwa au wataalamu kuja Tanzania tukakaa pamoja au tukatumia mitandao yetu kwa maana video conference kuzungumza na kubadilishana mawazo ili na sisi tupitie hatua mlizozipitia kuzuia maambukizi. E, hizo ndio hatua ambazo tunaendelea kuzichukua na wakati wote tumekuwa busy na hilo sehemu kubwa ya shughuli zetu tunaangalia hilo na tumeanza kuona pia athari za kiuchumi biashara nyingi zimekufa hatuna watalii hoteli zetu hazifanyi kazi maeneo ya kibiashara kuna bidhaa na bidhaa nyingi kwa zipata kutoka china leo china isafirishi bidhaa lakini tumefurahi kusikia kwamba mmeanza 
kazi kule China viwanda vinazalisha kwa ni vizuri kwa sababu sisi tutapata sasa bidhaa kutoka China e, kupitia ndugu zetu kupitia wafanyabiashara ili uchumi wetu usiweze kuyumba kwa lakini pia tunahitaji pia uzoefu wenu wa namna mlivyoweza kumudu kufanya uchumi kubaki ukiwa kama ulivyo ingawa na nyie pia mnasema mmetetereka lakini utetelekaji wenu sio kama nchi zetu hizi kwa hiyo tunapata tunahitaji pia kupata uzoefu wenu jambo hili litatufanya sipe na sisi Tanzania tukae vizuri kwa hiyo tuhakikishie kwamba tutapata tutapokea misaada yote ambayo mtatuletea ili saidie pia timu zetu isaidie watu wetu katika kupambana na maambukizi haya ya ugonjwa huu wa corona na ushuru sana mheshimiwa balozi na kwa kuwa tuko hapa pamoja tutaendelea kubadilishana mawazo wakati wote karibu sana tupo pamoja <laughs> thank you thank you so much the government of China has right now undergone a assistance to the uh, epidemic uh, in, in, in impacted countries, African countries. Sure. So the, the, the assistance to uh, mainland China, mainland, mainland Tanzania, mainland and Zanzibar are underway. Sure. Uh, for mainland, they, they are expected to arrive next week. We are, we, are, we are continue to do more in order sure, to support sure, Tanzania, sure, sure. and uh, uh, and as well this this happening as well in the in international international uh, internationally, actually we provide support to uh, the uh, epidemic affected countries Europe sure. Asia. Uh, many countries mm. and sending medical team and sharing Chinese experiences and we think that is uh, you know because at the very beginning the international countries foreign countries <coughs> provided us a lot of support <coughs> so we want to reciprocate this is our the virtue of our tradition of our culture sure, sure. if you receive uh, if you receive the, 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 the uh, how to say, peaches, and then we'll return with the plums. <laughs> and also it's our, uh, the practice of our foreign policy of uh, building up the uh, community of shared, shared destiny uh, of mankind, as, as put forward by our president, Xi Jinping.